they get a huge bonus against mounted units. So you finished the trebuchet, but is there any money buildings you can build? A harbor and a market, so build both of those. Ah, Apostolic Palace, we get to set a vote. We can try to stop the war against Brennus or against Gilgamesh. I guess Brennus and Gilgamesh are still at war. We can stop trading with some of the infidels, Willem, Asaka, Isabella, or have everyone declare war on Isabella. Interesting. Hmm. No, I don't actually like that idea because of a few things. One, I don't want anyone else stealing her cities because they're going to be all mine because she is just wimpy. I'm going to roll right over her. I don't need any help. Plus, if I vassalize her while she's at war with someone, I sort of, I think, I end up being at war with the other people. I'm not sure, though. I don't remember how it works. So, no, none of those votes. I could have gotten everyone to stop trading with, like, someone else, but then everyone would just hate me, and I don't want to be hated like that. Oh, wow. Willem Van Orange. The Dutch are way down here. They probably sailed. But I am going to be the first Civ to make this sort of intercontinental voyage, which is very exciting. Okay, you guys. Bombard this city, which has huge defenses. It's going to be a while. A couple of turns at least before we're able to break through. But I'm bringing more troops, so that's good. You just sit tight there. Where's the other caravel? There it is. A catapult. Um, yeah, money stuff, money stuff, money stuff. Harbor. Build the harbor. And you just keep heading west. Bombard. And we're going to head east. Oh, my peace treaty with Gilgamesh is over, which means we can declare war on each other again if we'd like. I didn't realize. Ten turns have passed already. Wow, it's going slow. Uh, you can build a market, I thought. Yeah, so do that. Okay, you guys. Oh, the Celts just captured a, another Sumerian city. That is very exciting. Because I still want the Celts to be winning here. Bombard. Defense is down to six. Excellent. That's what I like to see. Doesn't actually have that many defensive units, so I'm going to throw two sort of suicide trebuchets in here. Wow, that's a lot of upgrades on these guys. And they get a huge bonus to attacking cities, so we're going to see how this goes. Yes, lots of collateral damage. And hopefully it'll withdraw without dying. It does. That's Excellent news. In fact, it took hardly any damage. And a repeat performance on the second one. It's just whipping them in the head. It's so funny. Excellent. They both survived. So now, we're going to kick some ass. City Raider 3. Uh, still only 63%, though. That is harsh. Maybe losing him. I'm losing one of my most upgraded units here. Ah, uh, it's the crossbowman. They get like 50% bonus against melee. Survives! Excellent. And this unit actually has a bonus against uh, archers, so that is good. He's still only 65% though. Wow. Nice one, boys. Excellent, now we're in the 93% range. Feeling good about this. He loses. Uh, but that's life, I guess. Um, yeah, okay, against Macemen. So you can see how saving the promotions like I do kind of pays off here, since I'm able to kind of adapt to what my opponents are presenting me. Try to maximize my chance of victory. Okay, I better win this one. It's like 99.1% to win. Whew, it's close though. 
96. We can bump it all the way up to 99.3. Good stuff. Maybe a maceman now, which is really good news for me since my maceman will just obliterate all his melee units. No questions asked. Oh, yeah. So only got a couple more units, I think. Maybe this may even be the last one. Nope, one more. Here we go. For the win! Yes, install a new governor. 170 gold plus 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 a granary, a monument, which is interesting. Uh, market, a courthouse. The Temple of Solomon, so that is the Jewish Holy Temple. It's currently pr producing 24 gold for me. Woo! And Stonehenge. Oh, that's why I have a monument, because normally all culture-producing buildings are destroyed when you take over a city, except for World Wonders, uh, which are still intact, but they, would not, they will not produce any culture for you. But the Stonehenge gives you a monument in every city, so I get that, which is kind of funny. And yeah, the city's in revolt right now, but it'll be out in seven turns. Meanwhile, we're using a lot of uh, specialists. Um, and what are you going to build? Well, I guess you're going to build a um, harbor. And everyone else move into the city to protect it. Mine, 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 mine. Huh. Could this be Hawaii? Maybe. Okay, oh, and this one, start heading west. In kind of a zigzag pattern. Okay, all you trebuchets head down to Madrid. You can head down here as well. Now, the question is, do we continue our domination of Isabella, or do we force capitulation? We'll see if it's even an option, first of all. It is. Yeah, for the... For peace, she would capitulate and give me her world map, which is interesting. So, I guess the question becomes, do I want Seville and Barcelona first? I certainly have the firepower. I have lots of units. Why can't I click on... Oh, right, because, duh, I can't look into cities because they're not mine. Okay, um... I got three units there, three units there, plus a boat. Yeah, I can easily walk all over this thing. In fact, I could start walking in that direction right now. I can split my army into two groups, hit both cities, and probably take them within three turns. All right, then I guess I'll do that. Oh, she's attacking me back. How rude. She's got trebuchets of her own. I mean, computer really has pretty good technology. I mean, they're pretty much on par with me. Macemen and trebuchets. I just have a higher production base going on, so that makes me happy. We can build universities and stuff, but yeah, we're going to need more... Even more troops. Just keep building me macemen for now. We're going to switch over to cannons soon as it becomes an option. Got another random island. I have no idea what that one's supposed to be. Okay, we gotta move all these units in here. So, we're going to take uh, we're going to take everyone who's relatively healthy. And we're going to move south with them. To Barcelona. And everyone who's kind of hurt just a little bit. Plus...